for that bed their final test and results of the ultrasound. And her husband has two to three months to live. So I pray that he can go as easily as possible. I prefer that God would save him. And it did look that way for a while. But at any rate, I pray that God will also give her a lot of strength if she's going to need it. Lord, Lord Jesus, I would like to pray for my friend Gordon Dunham and and his ex-wife, his ex-wife and uh, children are now homeless. Um, I just pray that they find a place to stay that is safe and comfortable. And we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus with us. I'd like to pray for my husband who has been diagnosed with cancer and he's just stubbornly refuses to believe in God and thinks that all burdens are his to bear alone which frustrates me. Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus us. I would like to pray for the hierarchy of the Roman Catholic Church, that they truly follow Jesus, who is the way, and who taught them the uh, value of women by choosing Mary to be the mother of the Son. And choosing women to be the first to acknowledge the resurrection. And for all of them, let us pray. Lord Jesus, journey with us. Let's pray for my mom to see the path of the Lord Jesus, journey with us. I'd like to pray for all of those people who are currently on kidney dialysis and need a transplant. Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus journey with us. For all those who suffer from addictions of any kind. Lord, Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus, journey with us. I ask you to keep in prayer uh, Bishop uh, Joe Finnegan, that some of you have met in this time of our church. Today is his 75th birthday. So you God uh, give him many blessings. We pray. Lord, Lord Jesus, journey with us. And for all the intentions that are in the silence of your hearts, and for those that are listed on our parish's website, we pray. Lord, 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 Lord Jesus, Jesus journey with us. us. Thank you, Lord, for staying with us. Warm the hearts of all of us with your kind words and your lasting friendship. For you are our Lord forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Our offertory song will be in the miscellet. Number 65. <clears throat>
pray my family that our sacrifice may be acceptable to our God. May the Lord accept the sacrifice of your hands. Praise the glory of God's name. For our good and for all of the church. Lord our God, loving Father, Hear our bread and wine, simple signs which your son walks with us on the dusty road of life. Let him set our hearts afire when he shares himself with us and speaks to us words that make life worth living. Let him be our food on the road to you and on the road to people. For we believe that he is our risen Lord who stays with us now and forever. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Lift up your hearts. We lift the hearts of the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. And we to give thanks to Father of all and ever living God, we do well always and everywhere to give you thanks through Jesus Christ our Lord. We praise you with greater joy than ever in this Easter season. When Christ became our pastoral sacrifice, in him a new age has dawned, the long reign of sin is ended, a broken world has been renewed, and we are once more made a whole. The joy of the resurrection renews the whole world, while the choirs of heaven sing, Forever to your glory. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of power, God of might, heaven and earth are full of your glory. All Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the When supper was ended, he took the cup. Again, he gave you thanks and praise. Gave the cup to his disciples and said, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. This is the cup of my blood, the blood of the new and everlasting covenant. It will be shed for you and for all, so that sins may be forgiven. Do this in memory of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of faith. Christ has died, Christ is risen, Christ will come again. Christ has died, Christ is risen, Christ will come again. In memory of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Father, this life-giving bread this saving cup. We thank you for counting us worthy to stand in your presence and serve you. May all of us who share in the body and blood of Christ be brought together in unity by the Holy Spirit. Lord, remember your church throughout the world. Make us for in love together with Francis, the Bishop of Rome, Terry, our Bishop, and all the clergy and the royal priesthood. Remember
remember our brothers and sisters who have gone to their rest in the hope of rising again. Bring them and all the departed into the light of your presence. Have mercy on us all. Make us worthy to share eternal life with Mary, the Virgin Mother of God, and St. Joseph, with all the apostles, with all the saints who have done your will throughout the ages. May we praise you in union with them and give you glory through your Son, Jesus Christ. As we sing. Through him with him in him, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours, Almighty Father, forever and ever. Amen, amen, amen.
as I said, all are welcome at the table of the Lord.
Let us pray. Our living God, your Son Jesus has spoken to us warm words of encouragement and hope. At this table, he has nourished us with the fresh bread of himself to sustain us on our pilgrim way to you and to one another. Let the food of this word and body keep us united in one faith, one love, and one common concern for all that is right and good. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. As the Mass, we'll be going to Hula Hands uh, for their brunch, buffet, uh, whatever. Uh, so if you'd like to join us, we always go out to eat after Mass. For those of you that are new, everybody's welcome. And uh, we did not have the class, as I mentioned yesterday, uh, for the Crock Pot Ministry. Jackie sent me a nice email because I asked her suggestions. She said, maybe we should wait because the school year is ending and uh, try back again when school starts up. I think that's a good idea because during the summertime, um, there, are, there are some programs falling or not, but they're harder to get. Hold on to a pack of them. So I think that's a good idea. And it will be working uh, uh, later. And uh, as again, if you have time this afternoon, you have nothing to do before 30, miles a lot. Good show. You won't regret it. Pillow talk and some of the commercials <laughs> from the 50s and, and whatnot. Tame commercials for the astronauts. And the crane. The crane. Ponds, whole cream. Whole cream. There's some really cool stuff that's in there for that. Father, do you have any? No, we're not. No announcements? <laughs> okay. Anyone from the community have announcements? I, I think Jackie's idea is good to wait if we're going to stay with the schools. <coughs> if we want to consider other programs. I'd be happy to look into contacting people at the Homeless Services Network for their women's transitional housing. Uh, there's also the Women's Resource Center has transitional housing, and Harbor House does also. And I know because of privacy and safety, we wouldn't be able to do a class there, but we might be able to provide booklets. I can contact. People. I worked at Harbor House at one time, so I may be able right. to. I, I and you've been out there. I'd be happy to look into that. We may or may not do it, but just in case, it's another option. To dovetail onto that, um, the Zebra Coalition. I don't know. I, they kind of, they offer sort of holistic help over there, so I'm sure that they have some sort of cooking class, but I'm not. I, I'm guessing, but I'm not sure. So that might even be something in their local, right. or their, across also, the street. Uh, seniors also may well benefit from um, new information on healthy cooking as their abilities decrease. They're not good with using the stove. I'm not good with using the stove. Right. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
if you look at me and you say, oh crap, I know where they came from. Oh. And I'm the line that's there. So that was awesome that I could actually see them this week. So God obviously gave me the, the real power to find out. So that was a cool thing in that sense. And who knows, someday we might talk. So God does work miracles. Congratulations. Thank you. Yes. That's wonderful. And now, let us bless the Lord. We have encountered our risen Lord. He spoke to us in his word and broke his bread for us. May we speak to one another his word that sets hearts afire with hope. May we be his bread that nourishes everyone around us. Take with you the blessings of Almighty God, and the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. As we say every week, and really mean it, the Mass never ends. It continues out there. there. And I'm closing here will be number 86. Today's been a miscellaneous. And you'll kind of sort of know the melody. Kind of sort of.